Hello, hello. We are going to be looking into the West Memphis 3 case. This has been highly requested over the last couple weeks, so let's try and see what happened here. Um, this case to me is a little overwhelming. There's a lot of moving parts, a lot of people, um, so I don't want to be the one to really explain this to you because I don't want to say anything incorrectly. Um, in the description, I will link the Wikipedia article for this case and a YouTube video that explains the case in more detail in case you'd like to watch that before watching this or after watching this, whatever. Um, so essentially, these three little boys, Steve, Michael, and Christopher, were out riding their bikes. Two of them had a bike, one of them did not. The one that did not have a bike rode on the back pegs of the other boy's bike. Um, so they were out riding around on their bikes after school and then later were found in or near the creek not alive. Um, one was stabbed, two were drowned, I believe. Um, three boys, three teenage boys who were like troubled boys in the area were arrested for this um, because one of them confessed and then recanted. Um but they have since been released. I forget what it's called, but like if you um, maintain your innocence, but take a guilty plea, I don't know, something like that. Um, anyway, look in the description if you wanna see more about the case, but I want to just jump into looking at what happened, if these boys that were arrested actually are responsible or not. This is an energy reading. It is all alleged, my opinion, no facts. Energy reading, alleged, my opinion, no facts. All right, so these, oh, um, what else happened? There was someone who said that she believes that she saw three bikes. Um, but as I said, the two boys only had two bikes. So there's question if there was a third person with them. Oh, and the other thing is, so they, where they were found, you go down into these woods, right? And then there's like this little bridge, um, that you would have to cross over to get from the side that the boys were on to the side where their bodies were found. Um, so they had to come over this bridge, right? And there's a lot of talk about how could one person get three boys on the other side of this bridge unless the boys knew them because it, it, it's like a little footbridge, not like a, not like a car bridge, like a little footbridge that's in the middle of the woods, like a little wooden one. Um, so anyway, they, they were found on the other side of this little bridge. It's not a long bridge, it's a little bridge. Um, okay, so boys are riding their bikes. Let's start with Steve, Michael, and Christopher. We're going to do two rows of five to start. And I, I wanted to start when the three little boys came together, whenever they started doing whatever they were doing. Again, this is energy reading, alleged, in my opinion. Two of Swords, Four of Wands, Ten of Wands, Seven of Wands, and the Sun. And that's the first row. That's interesting because the, the whole first row flipped over together exactly five cards. Hmm. So the Two of Swords is, a, is um, like trying to make some kind of difficult decision. The Four of Wands is the home environment and the Ten of Wands is a heavy burden. There was talk about potential, um, not good behavior happening in one of the homes with one of the parents or step parents or adoptive parents, something like that. One of the little boys had mentioned um, what was it? They like, he went missing before and they couldn't find him. And the aunt found him in a closet and he said he had an accident and to not let the, the step parent know. Anyway, um, two of swords, four of wands, 10 of wands to me is there's something going on in my home and the sun and seven of wands. Two of Swords, Four of Wands, Ten of Wands. There's something going on in my home that's very troubling. And the Sun, Seven of Wands, I need to tell someone about it because I, I don't want it to happen anymore. 
because seven of wands would be standing my ground and the sun would be the whatever was hidden coming to light the fool ten of swords reverse Eight of Wands. Huh. The Fool is giving me the image of them being lured somewhere. Four of Swords reversed. Eight of Swords reversed. Should I say what I'm thinking? The Hermit reversed, Queen of Swords. <laughs> Queen of Swords is like, yeah, say it. Um, I don't believe that the three boys who were arrested did this. This looks like something that came from within one of the homes of the victims. Um, this is, I am scared to say something, but if I don't say something, this burden is going to continue inside of the home environment. Seven of Wands, the sun, I need to let someone know about what's going on because I need to try and defend myself or protect myself. Fool, Ten of Swords, Eight of Wands is I'm driving by and I see you and I get an idea. Four of Swords reversed, Eight of Swords reversed. What's that word? Um, Pentence? Repentance? When you make a... Repentance, I guess? I don't know. Um, yeah, this is like... Um, how do I put this? This is, I'm driving by, I see these boys, I pull over to say something to them. I realize that when I roll down my window and say something to them, that the two boys that are with my son, stepson, something, um, I, I realize that when I roll down my window and say something to them, for example, um, they're scared or they look at me weird or I, I get this feeling that my this child told the other children what's going on in the house. So I like park and jump out of my car. Cause I'm tired of, I'm tired of constantly fearing that what's happening behind closed doors is gonna come out. The fool, I lead you somewhere. Eight of wands is like, Eight of Wands, Four of Swords Reversed, Eight of Swords Reversed is like, um, I'm trying to teach you a lesson, but I make some kind of really quick move and it goes too far. And Eight of Swords reversed, the Emperor, Page of Swords. Someone tried to run away and he was scared that they were going to talk. I wonder if that happened first. This is like, okay, so I'm driving by, for example, I see the boys, I roll down my window, I say something to the boys. Two of the boys are weird around me like they weren't before. I feel like the third boy told the other two boys what's going on in the house. I panic. I park. 
I go to the boys, I say, hey, help me with something really quick or follow me really quick. I guide them to the other side. I live in the area so I know where this bridge is. I know how to like guide them over there. I kind of trap them. So it's almost like they go over the bridge, they're guided over the bridge and then I block the bridge. I try to make an example out of one of the boys to scare the other two boys to not talk. I think that I'm gonna scare them enough one of them tries to run away, I grab that one, I hurt that one, or I take it too far because I'm trying to prevent them from running away because if they run away, they're gonna talk and then I don't have the control. So they try to escape and I snap, I take it too far. What was the person's original intention when they started luring the boys to the other side of the bridge? Oh. Death. Three of Pentacles reverse. Oh. Oh, hmm. The hermit reversed. Hmm. It wasn't pull up in the car. This is, I see the boys. I park my car. I approach the boys. I try to get one of the boys alone. but the other two don't leave. This would be like if the one boy told the other boys that there's something going on in the home and then all of a sudden that person that he was talking about shows up and the other two boys are like, oh, I'm not leaving you. I'm just gonna stay, not realizing what was gonna unfold. It's almost like I lure them into the woods because I'm trying to get the other two to just go away I do believe that one boy was the target here and he was trying to get them away from the other boys alone. Um, Cause I said before, it's like, I rolled down the window. I realize you're scared of me. It's not that it, it's, it's I'm trying to get this one alone and you won't go away. You won't leave us alone. I'm wondering if someone that, um, cause three of pentacles reversed with death is like, I'm supposed to be at work, but I'm not, or I left early or, but how would they not know that by now? What did the three boys who were arrested have to do with this, if anything? Six of Wands reversed. The Tower reversed. King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles reversed. Three of Pentacles. Um, Six of Wands reversed. The Tower reversed. King of Pentacles is like... You're somewhere where you're not supposed to be and I see you. Or like I, I see someone crouched down somewhere or something like that. But tower reversed, six of wands is like, I see something and I don't realize what I'm seeing. Or I don't recognize what I'm seeing. Um, the hierophant, higher knowledge. It's 
also like religion. It's weird. It's like, um, The, the three boys who were arrested, I don't believe have anything to do with this. Um, I really don't. This looks like coming from inside the home. Um, allegedly my opinion. But it's weird because like, there is something with the three boys, but it's, they like saw something or someone King of Cups reversed. Uh, yeah. It, um, yeah, this this is, uh, in my opinion, this came from inside the home. This is someone um, that is a caretaker, that is in a caretaker position of one of the victims. Um, It's almost like they they were in the position to see something, but they didn't see it. I don't know how to explain it. It's really weird. Like, I, I almost feel like they were right there when it happened, but it, it would be like if this was happening over here and they were paying attention over there. Like, I don't... Oh, the the hierophant is goes with the king of cups. Oh, hold on, that makes sense. Ace of cups reverse, knight of cups. They flipped it. Whoever did this saw the three boys, like the three that were arrested. The three that were arrested didn't see anything, but they were close enough to have seen something if they would have been looking in the right direction. Um, or like paying attention, I don't know. But whoever did it saw the three boys as they were leaving and they helped lead the investigation to those three boys because they saw them and said, oh, they're in the area I know these boys. I know that they have like a troubled reputation and I see them close enough that if anything, if anyone were to say, oh, I did see them. Yeah, Knight of Cups would be like, I'm like charming the investigator. Like, oh, well, you know, I did see these three boys in the area. Wow. Yeah. King oh, King of Cups crouched down. It's like, oh, it's like I okay. Okay, let me run through this. I'm the person who did it, right? Alleged no, like I'm not, but like I'm pretending to be. Um, let's clear that up. Um so I see the three boys walking. I realize that it's like kind of a good location for me to get this one boy separate so I can teach him a lesson because I don't want him talking to his friends or whatever, what have you. Um, I park my car, I get out, I approach the boys. I say I need help or I lure them somehow into the woods to the other side of the bridge. They get to the other side of the bridge. I block the bridge. I try to get the other two to leave or maybe I don't, I don't know what the plan was at that point. It feels like I try to get two of them to leave on the walk. Like as we're walking, I'm trying to get two of them to go away so I can have the one seclude it, but they won't go away because they know that that one is scared of me. I pick up on that. I'm planning on making an example of the one in front of the other two so they don't run and say anything because they'll be scared. In the midst of this plan unfolding, I realize it's not going to work because one of them tries to run away. I grab that one. I almost feel like that's the one that was stabbed. Is that the one that was stabbed that tried to run away? Five of Pentacles. Yeah. Um, 
that would be like I'm really worried about you actually getting away because you almost got away and as you're running away the other two could have ran away but they didn't because they're scared so now I'm really mad at you I stab you the other two are just kind of scared frozen um I, I like I stab you a little bit and then I tie them up and then I go back to stabbing you or something I don't um so anyway I do all this um and I'm I like hear something or something I don't know maybe maybe just like being very cautious about leaving where I was but I'm like crouched somewhere waiting for the coast to be clear and I see these three boys And then I know they're in the right place at the wrong time, right? So that I can use that to my advantage. But it's weird because Knight of Cups with King of Cups reversed and Ace of Cups reversed and Hierophant, King of Pentacles. It, it does make me feel like this person that did do this has some kind of friend in authority um, or at least someone that, that would trust them coming to, inf coming with information. Like I saw these boys or something like that. Like, um, more than acquaintances, I guess you could say, like, like, it's not like this person went to police and confessed and said, oh, I did this, but let's set up these boys instead. It, it was like they charmed their way into getting what they wanted to happen to happen. But it's weird. It's, it's almost like if this happened here, it's like the other boys were like right over here, but didn't actually see anything, but they were seen by the person who did it and hence set up. I mean, I guess it's possible they may have seen the bodies after, but I don't, I don't really think so. The world, queen of pentacles, three of swords reversed. Uh, It reads more to me like, um, like, like in the three boys that were arrested, it's like, I find out about this story. I'm getting interrogated. I realized that I actually was right in the area and maybe I looked in that direction and I'm imagining what I saw. Like, I don't know. Like, it's like. It, it it's almost feels like there was a confession because the person knew that they were very close to where the bodies were actually found. Like I was right over here at the same period of time. So like, I don't know how to explain it. Um, hanged man and three of cups. Yeah, they were hanging out right around. I would say they were probably within Thirty feet of the bodies, but didn't see the bodies. I mean, I guess it's possible they did. It feels more like they didn't, but um, or maybe they weren't sure about what they saw because the hangman can be uncertainty. Um, but the three who were arrested were absolutely seen by the person who actually did this. So there's like a bunch of um, evidence that I, uh, so it, it was said in the one documentary that I watched last night, um, I think the police said that there was a fire and it was destroyed, but then it turns out there wasn't a fire and it wasn't destroyed. And there's like other evidence, I guess, that went missing or something or that they won't provide because they don't want to reopen the case. <clears throat> so... What does that have to do with this? Is like, is that being done on purpose? Five of Wands. Huh.
that's interesting. Nine of Cups, Page of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody's pulling the string. Someone doesn't want it to actually come out. But it's not because of who they're protecting. It's because they're protecting fumbling it in the first place. Um, also, Page of Pentacles, maybe somebody was paid off. It feels more like covering my butt than being paid off, but there could be some kind of kickback. Eh, Nine of Cups, Page of Pentacles. There, there's, there could be some kind of kickback or advantage to um, continuing to cover this up. But it would be less about the person that they're protecting and more about some kind of reward that they're getting for it in the first place. Because it's not protecting the person, it's protecting dropping the ball in the first place. Um, five of Wands, it could be that there's two different sides. Maybe there's people who do want to look into this and there's people who don't in terms of investigators. Um, but it seems as though the nothing to see here people are the ones who are winning. Um... see what was the the person who did this I, I do believe it's one person um what is their energy before they saw the boys when they started luring the boys uh when the murders were happening and then after so before they saw the boys driving around in their car Poet of Avon, the storyteller. Fame, stagnation, and pride. The storyteller. Yeah, I think that one of the kids was going to come forward about some kind of abuse in the home. The storyteller's like, oh, you're just telling stories. You're just lying. But in reality, I'm the one that's telling stories and lying. Okay, so when he saw the boys in reverse, Danu, mother of creation, motherhood, ferocity, creation. This is, I see my opportunity to get this boy alone, away from the home, away from the mother. I don't know to, I, I have to, I'm going to do a second reading on this because I, I want to do like, um, a family tree type of reading and look at people individually but this to me feels more like not a biological parent I don't know which ones had a biological father in the home and which ones didn't but this feels like not a biological father but there was a biological mother in the home Um, when it was happening, when the murders were happening. In reverse, the Leopard King, Sword of Law, bravery, self-discipline, and faith. But it was in reverse, self-discipline. I lost control. The law, like, it, from the beginning, how do I get out of this? How do I not get caught? And then I'm scratching down, I see these three boys, and boom, there's my in. There's my way to not get caught. bravery in reverse is cowardice because I lured these three little boys and then self-discipline yeah I just lost control um afterward after the killings downcast pride and blind it to pain after the killings downcast pride because oh I didn't mean to kill these three little boys I wanted to just lure one of them away and then blinded to pain oh well I just need to turn this off and keep going on with my life hmm. their energy now the person who did this their energy today alone in the world
Did, does anyone else at this point know about this? Like, does anyone that is close to the actual killer know the devil in reverse? Uh-uh. Four of Pentacles reverse. It's almost like if there is someone who questions, like, oh, I wonder if, it's like they can't do anything about it because they rely on this person for something, like money or maybe they're scared of them. Um, maybe they just aren't sure and don't want to even try and find out for sure. Devil reverse, though, it could be an abusive situation. I don't believe the person like told anyone like, hey, by the way, I did this. I think that they kept it to themselves. But I do think there's people around them that question. Did, did anyone lie about an alibi for this person? Six of Swords reversed, Seven of Pentacles reversed. Lie about an alibi. Uh... Maybe more like I said something without being all the way sure about it or Six of Swords reverse though. It does feel as though there is abuse in this home that goes beyond what the child was experiencing. It does seem like there's some relationship um At the very least, manipulation, at the most, physical abuse. Um, I think it's more of like emotional, but like sometimes veers towards physical abuse. But it's almost like I say something to you like, oh, well, we were doing this, blah, 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 right? And then you're like, yeah. And then that wasn't really what happened, but you don't remember it that way, if that makes sense. Like, I confuse you and get you to accidentally give a better alibi for me than I should have had. Or, like, I confuse you on the time of something. Or... Slew of Swords reverse. Yeah, it's like someone... Someone was misled, said something small, it it gave a solid alibi for someone, but it's not the truth, but it's not that they're purposely lying, it's just that they were misled or don't remember the, the right thing and they were told what the right thing was. It, this would be like, for example, like we're getting questioned and I'm like, oh, well, remember we were sitting on the couch from blah, 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 to blah, 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 but really like it wasn't that time or it wasn't that long or maybe you fell asleep. I, I, where was the person coming from when they saw the boys? Eight of Cups. Oh. Chariot Reverse. It almost feels like they were looking for the boys. Like, um, your mom is here. I see the opportunity. I know you went to ride your bike. I'm going to go confront you now because I know that I can make it look like I was here. Maybe like someone was taking a nap or... I don't know. It's like someone someone was misled into giving a false alibi without realizing that they were doing it. But it feels like whoever this was didn't... Oh, Knight of Swords. Yeah, they didn't just stumble on the boys. They were looking for him. 
Did something happen right before the boys left? The moon reversed. Oh. Seven of Swords. One of the boys said that they were going to tell somebody about the abuse. This is like, we're arguing or something, maybe on the phone, maybe face to face, maybe it was earlier in the day, I don't know. Um, but one of the boys says like, oh, well, I'm going to, if you do that, I'm going to tell so-and-so. Um, and then I'm mad about it. And I finally see the opportunity to where I can go look for you because I kind of know where you're at. And I can approach you not in the home. because seven of swords is betrayal and strategy ace of swords and strength reverse i'm gonna talk to you and i'm gonna i'm gonna scare the crap out of you i'm gonna talk to you and overpower you with my words so that you're too scared to do what you said you were going to do however i'm going to see how you react and i see that you either already told these other boys or I just don't trust that you're not going to go tell somebody else. So I realize I'm going to lure you. And then I overpower you. Page of Cups. Yeah, I believe there was one target. It was one child that was a target, but the other two knew that the one was scared of the person that was approaching them, so they stayed with him to protect their friend. Then when they realized what was happening, one of them tried to run away. That's the one that was stabbed. The other two were too scared to run away at that point. They got tied up. Tie them up, finish with that one, and then drown the other two. Allegedly, my opinion. And then I'm crouched down, waiting for the coast to be clear so I can get back inside before the mom knows that I'm missing or gets home, whatever. Um, And as I'm waiting, I see these three boys and then I can place them at the scene. Did the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, wrong place, wrong time. The, the three boys were just unlucky. Um, a case of wrong place, wrong time. Does the person who did this know the three boys who were arrested personally? Six of Pentacles. Hmm. From the community, the Empress reverse. From the community, but not like a personal relationship. I, the person who did this is kind of off-putting to like, general people like one of those like if you if you're my friend I'm nice to you but if not I kind of standoffish um what was the main reason that the person who did this was bothered by the boy that was the main target drastic extreme harsh cut off and it's a car on there. Yeah, this person went looking for this boy. Drastic, extreme, harsh, cut off. It's like, you're a problem. I don't want you around anymore. Tragedy, forbidden love. It's almost like, like there was maybe behavior problems with one of the boys and it was having an effect on the person's relationship with the, the boy's mom. 
and they're both like all of these cards aren't black and white right but both of these came out black and white drastic and tragic or tragedy And this is like I said that the person went looking for them in their car and then this is like a woman that's like that. So I don't think that the, the mom knows or knew. I think it was like I sneak out but not long enough that I still can't use you for my alibi. Let's see what we get here. I pulled two of these too. Closer observation of the victim's living space may provide further clues. It's from inside a home. Allegedly my opinion. No facts. Allegedly my opinion. I believe that someone from one of the boys' homes is who did this. The murder weapon will provide valuable clues, and it's the, the knife that was used. I mean, this is pretty much what the whole reading was about. Someone from inside the home and kind of like how it, how it happened. Um, Was the knife used from the home? Like, was it like a knife that they had in the home previously? I mean, I guess it would have to be, right? Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. This person, like, knows how to use a knife, though. Maybe they hunt or something, or... Um... You know, it's interesting too, there's like a bird flying while he has the knife. I really feel as though he was doing something, one of them tried to run away, he snapped, grabbed that one, stabbed that one, and then tied the other two. Because the other two were then too scared to try and run away because they were like, okay, I'll get stabbed if I try and run away. family and it's in the woods sitting on the dirt social media in reverse yeah whoever actually did this has kind of pulled back from life which i'm sure that a lot of the victims families have so that doesn't really narrow it down but um weird science in reverse Weird times, but in reverse. I'm curious if any of the moms were taking a nap at this time or like could have fallen asleep without realizing. It's almost like maybe they were given something to... given something so that when they wake up it's just like oh i i don't know how to explain it. like oh i fell asleep while we were together the whole time perversion boner zone private property and military Private property is the home environment. Military would be an operation. Boner zone. It's, I think that someone was given something so that they took a nap. And then they woke up and they provided an alibi because they're like, oh, I fell asleep for five minutes, not realizing it was actually longer than that. This is like... Me and a little boy have a fight in the morning either 
And then I, I, I plan on confronting him. So I give the mom something so I can sneak out when he goes out to ride the bike. Like this was pretty planned. This was pretty planned, but it was only planned for one boy. But this card does make me feel like it, someone was taking a nap and gave some kind of alibi based off of thinking that the other person was still there with them. Allegedly, my opinion. Dating in reverse. Yeah, that. Because look, they're holding hands, but it's in reverse. It's like I thought we were in bed together the whole time taking a nap, but I didn't realize that you got up and snuck out because I was dead asleep because I was given something. Fraud and secret society in reverse. Yeah, fraud. I'm faking and secret society in reverse. You don't know. Let me know if this makes sense, but it feels like someone gave a false alibi based off of taking an unexpected nap and then thinking that someone else was there with them when they actually weren't. Okay, um, I'm going to stop for now because I want to do a little bit more research into like the dynamic of the family so I can look into them separately, specifically. But let me know if you have any questions about this case and I will talk to you soon.